The Tatarstan Airlines plane is thought to have exploded on impact, bursting into flames as it made a second attempt to land. This amateur video was filmed shortly afterwards. The Boeing 737 had taken off from Moscow at around 20 past six on Sunday evening, an hour before it arrived at the airport in Kazan. The city is the capital of the Tatarstan Republic, a wealthy region with large deposits of oil. Anxious relatives gathered at the airport to examine the list of victims. The crash had no survivors. Fifty people are thought to have died, including six crew members. Among the dead are Irek Minikhanov, the son of Tatarstan's governor, and Alexander Antonov, who headed the regional branch of the Federal Security Service. Russia has one of the worst air safety records in the world. In April last year, at least 31 people were killed when a plane crashed after takeoff in Siberia. In September, another 10 people died when an Antonov AN-28, similar to this one, came down in the Kamchatka Peninsula. The country's last fatal accident was in December, when a Russian-made plane crashed at a Moscow airport, killing five people. It's not yet clear what caused the crash in Kazan. We're looking into all reasons for the crash, but the first ones to look into are, of course, a failure of machinery, fault of crew, weather conditions and bad quality fuel. As the investigation gets underway, the airport remains closed and Tatarstan begins a day of mourning. Tim Ullman, BBC News.